This is the Hokoska, aka Box Skyline. This one is special. It's kind of like the Halo car. Wow. Welcome to my garage. It's a lot of people's dream cars, but it's absolutely beautiful. It's done amazingly well all the way through, all the little details, no stone unturned. Let's check it out. What's up? What's up, Larry? What's your name? Mike Castillo. Where are you from? I'm from San Diego, California. Thank you so much for bringing out your car. No worries, man. It's always fun. To say it's uh, beautiful and it's perfect, it's kind of an understatement. It's kind of a, one of those things where it's a long time coming, right? I mean, you've been building it for a while. About 13 years I've been having this car and then ever since day one, I've been changing things here and there. But for me, I feel like it's a good stopping point, right? Yes and no. I mean, there's always some improvement. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna redo the suspension, get some custom arms made front and rear for adjustable toe and camera, everything. Uh -huh. You know, I do want to track the car a little bit. No, no, it's so perfect. It's so good. Let's just start off with the heaters. Let's check out the engine bay right off the bat. This thing is so cool. The paint is like glass. It is perfect. Small engine. Just a tiny engine. I love gold. I mean, I guess it's a more copper than it's anything copper else. But, oh, so it's actually it's copper plated. Actually copper plated yeah. Oh, that is so cool. I mean, everything is so finished. Like this is all shaved. Correct. And this is the original plate the here? Original plating, yes. Oh, that is so cool. When I first got it, they actually put the plating over here and I put it back in the right position. The holes were still there. I was like, holy, the plate's supposed to be here. So what's the story with this? How did you get this originally 13 years ago? Actually, my buddy had it in storage and he's been looking for a two-door. And I was actually building a Ken Mary at the time with an SR20 motor. And uh, probably 70% of the build, he calls me up and goes, hey, I'm selling my four-door. I'm like, crap. I sold all my cars, had to pick this thing up. I'm glad you did because this really is the ultimate four-door classic Skyline. Of course, you have an updated Skyline motor, but everything looks brand new. All of the little, just the tiniest things, like all the bolts, the master cylinder, all of it looks brand new. It's so clean. So you did all of this yourself in your garage? Actually, me and the guys, me and all the guys from Team Wildcards, they, they, they put their hands on this car with me. Even my little niece, she's like 10 years old helping me ranch on the car. Yeah, that's what I like, a team effort. That is super cool. I like that Bosuzoku like oil cooler. That's actually functional, right? Yes, it's functional. I had to, the, the car was actually, uh, the oil was getting really hot. We're like, you know, when I did an oil change, it was like really thin, like water. You're like, oh shoot, we need an oil cooler on this thing. So it is an FC oil cooler and we just made some custom brackets. Made sure to make the oil cooler just a, bit, a little bit lower so you can see like a little bit of the holes on the, on the valence. And tell me about the wheels. These are super rare. Huh? These Watanabe uh, Gotti wheels, very, very ultra rare. Actually, you don't really see Gotti wheels with emblems. And this is one that did get an actual Watanabe emblem. Uh -huh. And you won't see that. You wow. won't really see that. Yeah. They're in the rears are uh, 11 and a half and in the fronts, nine and a half. Nine and a half, 15 inch. 15, yeah, 15 inch. Okay. All the way around. Wow, okay, so it's almost square in the rear. <laughs> yeah, that's super cool. And uh, what kind of tires are you running? I'm running uh, Toyos. Toyo Proxies, Triple uh, Eights. You need every bit of those Triple Eights <laughs> to keep traction on this thing, huh? Yeah, when it, when it gets boosting, it's well, moving. So how much power are you actually making out of this? Um, we haven't fully dynoed it yet, but it's, we're, right now we're close to like 420 to 450 mm -hmm. on pump gas. That's... yeah a lot it's, to handle. It's a lot. I have a stock, very, very stock, even on stock wheels, stock airbox, R32 GTR. And that thing is already fast enough. It's going to get me in trouble. The thing is so nice for a 90s car. I couldn't imagine in a car like this. This is kind of one of the things that sets a lot of builds apart. The interior is so cool. It has so much character. Yeah. Um, when I first got this dash, actually, um, it had like a lot of cracks and uh, my buddy, he's like, hey, I got another dash. And it's actually an, not NOS Nissan dash that he saved. And he goes, here, here you go. And then... Uh, that just doesn't <laughs> exist. That just doesn't exist. I mean, it's like when your team members, 
right. are there for you. Like, I mean, they're they're there for you. Got this new uh, number seven dry carbon wheel, number seven belts. This is a hippo seat, old fiberglass hippo seat. Um, a lot of gifts from a, a lot of friends. They came, went to Japan and got the Lucky Cats. Mm -hmm. uh, does have a, it does have a Microtech computer, and I got the, the everything everything I need to tune on the on the go. I can tune while I'm driving if I needed to and adjust anything. Wow. Yeah. How is this to drive on the street? It's actually not too bad. It's, it's only a stage two plus, stage three clutch, so it's not really too grabby. It, 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 it holds the power. And not only that, you actually have room for real passengers in the rear. Correct. That seat right there is actually for my niece. That's her side. That's why oh, she's got the handle with her scrunchie on there. That's oh, her that's, seat. <laughs> that's awesome. That's her seat, yeah. It's a, a Mickey Mouse handle. Yeah. That is yeah. so cool. Yeah. From Disney Tokyo. Uh, and you kind of have like a, a half cage in here, huh? Like Correct. a roll bar? Yeah. yeah, it's half cage. Uh, my buddies, he uh, actually called me up. He goes, hey, you want me to do your cage? I go, sure. Uh, whipped it out in about three hours. Wow. It looks pretty cool, actually. You did a very good job. Yeah, yeah. it's pretty yeah. functional. I love the color, too. Why did you paint it purple, dark purple? I went to a show, and I almost got hit by an R33 coming through. And I looked at it, and I'm like, okay, that's the color I want. That's it. <laughs> it, it was done. It was it a was midnight done. purple? Yeah, it was midnight purple. So this is actually midnight purple? Yes. Like the actual paint code? Yes. Has clear lenses, taillights. That's not, that's not stock. I found them maybe five, six years ago on Yahoo, and I had never seen another pair again after that. And they're uh, LED um, taillights that were uh, custom made for me. It's a factory exhaust, but since I have turbocharged, I had it cut in the middle with a, with a valve opening so I, so I could have the full three inch all the way. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. yeah. But I could keep it quiet too and just buy a switch. Right. <laughs> what about the suspension? The suspension, the fronts I made, they're out of a, uh, like a 2000 Civic. I had him have my buddy uh, weld it onto the, the struts, strut housings, and they're all, they're all screw in uh, Civic uh, coilovers from Tain. And then the rears are made from Bills, B I L S, and they're, they're a coilover, and then the shock has a reservoir. The brakes have uh, front wheel wood for now, but right now I'm actually making brackets to run, I want to run Nissan again. So I, my, my buddy just gave me a set of R32 GTR brakes for free yesterday. You kind of like take donations from all these guys on your team to yeah. kind of update your car. That's so cool. Yeah. Very cool. I just love this thing so much. Car. Yeah, okay, all right. Sir, please. <laughs> Family car. Oh. oh my god. Oh, that is crazy. <laughs> it's so crazy. It's so fast. It's unbelievably fast. It sounds so good. Oh, that's what it sounds like when the RB is uncorked. Wow, I don't even know what to say. <laughs> That's a wrap. Thank you so much for showing oh, us your you. car. It's absolutely beautiful. And it may or may not have scared the <laughs> out of me. And also we may or may not have jumped it. 